The salty sea air never gets old. That poor man. He had quite a gruff personality. Not very sociable. But I don't think he meant to offend people. I hope he's very happy, wherever he is. Certainly. Matters now, though. Oh, my poor ship. Now leave me be. Thanks again for the canvas. That place is haunted. Every time I go there, I hear weird sounds. And some nights the windows light up. It's kind of creepy. I'm not scared of ghosts, though. That place is neat. My mom takes me there sometimes, but I'm not allowed to go by myself. He's some really old guy. I'm pretty sure. Hello again. His disappearance was all very mysterious. I don't believe anyone's seen him in a long time. Oh yes, I saw that from the ship. It looked as if there was a light coming from inside. Could it be a lighthouse?
What are you doing out so late? Oh, dear. I must ask that you tell no one about this. The information you have is already too close to uncovering the truth. I'm delivering surprise to... someone who is hiding in the old tower. That old tower was once used to communicate urgent messages to Nava using signal fires. Some years ago, the need for such a tower faded, and it fell to ruin. That old tower? Someone has taken up residence there. I suppose one could say this person is hiding out. They wish not to be bothered by anyone, and that's something I can relate to. This person wishes to remain unknown, and I mean to respect their wishes. I help lock it up, and only I hold the key to enter. I deliver supplies at night. I think they feel that the world of people is no place for them. I'm not sure this is the right solution, but the choice is not mine to make. I do hope you decide to keep this a secret. Its exposure means nothing to you and everything to the one who dwells in the town. Well, I suppose you've already connected the dots. I knew someone would guess it eventually. The one who dwells in the tower is the architect of New Linda. The one who designed the beautiful buildings. The one who has been missing for years now. Maybe this is for the best. Perhaps it's time someone talked to him. And maybe it's best if it's an outsider. I think, deep down, he doesn't want to be living in the tower. He is rash, and he is proud. Will you talk to him? I'll leave the door unlocked for you. Who are you? How did you get in? I presume the old man told you why I'm here? Why I've chosen to live in this tower of solitude? When I lived in Lindau, I was an outsider. For a time, I considered moving far away to a new city, where no one would know me. But I came to learn that I would be an outsider wherever I went. Look at my face! It makes children cry. Before I left, I was the subject of chronic nightmares for one child. Her father showed her a new route to school so she could avoid passing me. Estranged from all others in this tower, I am an outsider. But living in the town, I am an outsider all the same. At least here in my tower, I won't fuel the nightmares of children. I dedicated my life to becoming a great architect. For half a century, I labored at this. I built the city they live in. And how do the people of Lindau know me? I am the disfigured architect. The townspeople don't appreciate what I've done. They dwell in the marvel of my life's work. Really? What did it say of me? So, someone's finally taken notice of my talent? Well, that is interesting. That changes everything. It's about time, this conversation. It was almost enjoyable. <laughs> Perhaps I'll see you again. But now I'm afraid it's late. Or early, I should say. But I don't believe I invited you into my house.
This building is truly a marvel. A masterwork of architecture it is. Yes. It would have been a shame to have designed such a beautiful city and not enjoy it for myself a little longer. I've decided I'm going to move away. It pains me to think that I'll leave behind my creations, but it pains me more to think of more interactions with these wretched townspeople. Which actually brings me to something I wanted to ask you. I have some work for a painter like you. Mistake me not, painting is an objectively inferior art form. Especially when compared to something as functional as architecture. But in this one instance, I could use your skills. This may be the one time your skills would be useful. I'd like a painting of this very city. The composition should include this very town hall, the perched gazebo, and the inn. If you hesitate too long, I'll just find someone else. You painters are a glowstone a dozen. The painting of my city. It's splendid, truly. Thank you. And I should also thank you for before. I'm glad you visited me in my town. I'd like some time to myself. This is indeed a special place. And I'd like to enjoy it as much as possible before I go. Thanks for everything. I need some time to myself. This is indeed a special place, and I'd like to soak it in as much as possible before I leave.